What's going on again, YouTube? I'm going to give you a two for on Sunday. I'm doing a water change on the 29, so I wanted to show you what it looks like. Also getting ready to do my first trimming on the rosafolia, my first big trimming. Um, you can see it's turned almost completely red now. It's so pretty. Um, it's grown really full and dense at the top, which is good. Uh, but I'm going to do some trimming on the tops. I'm going to plant some more over here. And then also some more in this corner. You can see I've already kind of started. There's some plants back there that weren't there before. Um, it's just been growing super fast, and you know you have to trim plants on you know on occasion to keep them growing healthy. Um, in the front, you can see how fast this chain sort has also grown. Uh, this one right here is probably the biggest mother plant, and you can see one of the runners that shoots off. They have these long stems and shoot the the roots down towards the the bottom towards the soil. So probably going to clip that and replant it here in the front. All these um, smaller plants up here in the front are our runners I've you know trimmed and replanted so this thing that actually grows super fast uh, you actually have to to watch it it's kind of invasive sometimes so it occasionally sends a runner towards the back and I have to clip that you know make sure it grows where I want it to grow otherwise it can take over the tank I've heard um, but as you can see also the the water is crystal clear right now ever since I've added this uh, that fluval canister over there um, I've noticed a really improved clarity uh, from the water. You can see as I'm doing my water change down here, this bucket is, I don't know, it's just as clear as when I put it in. I mean, this is, you know, the, the water I'm taking out to put new water in, but it's still, you know, super clear. So everything's looking really healthy in this tank. I'm really, really happy with how this 29 is looking. Um, so I'm going to keep up the hard work on this one. Still not, you know, where I want it, but it's really, really moving in the right direction. The fish are all still, uh, still doing really well. The angels are peaceful, the rasbora is schooling. This tank's looking good. Got some work to do on this 20 long over here. Um, you can see the the Anubias are growing pretty well, um, but have some work to do on this tank. The balance isn't quite there. I've been combating a little bit of algae. Um, this light, I think, might be a little strong for the Anubias. It's only 36 watts, but it's only 12 inches from the, the bottom of the substrate, too, so have cut down a little bit on my lighting. I was originally lighting it about nine hours a day. I've cut that down to six and I'm hoping that helps. These Anubias are getting a little bit of algae on the leaves so I'm gonna cut down on my lighting times and also probably put a few more Otos in this tank. They're still really green um, it's just there's a there's a bit of a well you probably can't see because they're so green but there's in that back plant especially since it's a little bit taller there's a quite a bit of green spot algae growing on some of the leaves um, the cores are still doing really good. Some of them are hanging out over here. Probably going to put a few more of them in here in about a week. I'm going to do a water change and then put some uh, stability, some sea chem stability in here and probably add a few more fish in the coming weeks. So that's where that's going. It's kind of slow, um, but moving in the right direction. So once again, thanks for watching my videos, people. Hoping you're having a great Sunday. Peace.